be Deportivo Nacional in the red and green from left to right. Inter Moengo to pull from right to left in the yellow. Here in Maya against Puerto Rico where the sun has finally peeked through the clouds after a weather delay pushed kickoff back about a half an hour. Eleven teams begin here in the 2022 CONCACAF Caribbean Club Shield. One winner will have a chance to make the Scotiabank CONCACAF League. And here we go. Match number one here in Group C between Deportivo Nacional and Inter Moengo Tapo. If you would have told someone midway through the first half that this game would have ended 5-2, I think they would have thought you were lying. Not many chances. This was one of the few in the first half from Gerald Vikes. Some promising attacks going forward, but neither side really able to do much with it until this one was tapped in by Romeo Castillo. Got it through the legs on that last minute deflection. And then on the other side, Joshua Aguirre just lines up from about 30 yards and knocks that one home. Supply the service on this corner that Clarissa couldn't get on target. Now Kenroy Ranger picks his head up and picks out the run from Davis Oliveros. Slips by the back line, chest it down, pokes it home, two to one at the 55 minute mark. And then just the next couple of 10 minute periods would change things drastically. In the 65th minute, this straight red card against Kenroy Ranger would change the whole game. You could see the shock on his face. Felt that he made the tackle with the top of the boot, not the bottom, shown the red regardless. And then from there, it was all Inter Moengo to Po. This penalty comes, 72nd minute, converted. Right. Joel Baia, then the reins came. A minute later, Ronaldo Kemble scores. He had just come in as a sub right after Joel Baia scored. And then down the wing, Mikel Darson slips all the way through. Easy tap in for Mikel Mole. And then just to wrap things up, Kemble shot deflected on the way through, and it made it five to two. Inter Moengo to Po, a big victory here in the first match of Group C. They will sit atop Group C at the end of the day with a 5-2 win over Deportivo Nacional of Aruba.